minutes. Now to the gridlock alert in Midtown Manhattan today. No shocker given that the current president and two former presidents are in one location. Traffic tough, of course, whenever the president is in town. But tonight at a big fundraiser at Radio City, Mr. Biden will be joined by former presidents Obama and Clinton. Also complicating traffic tonight, protests planned by groups calling for a ceasefire in Gaza. The UN Security Council, of course, now also making that same plea to the world. I want to see reporter Lindsay Tucker with the story. She's live in Midtown for us. Lindsay. Things have gotten really busy down here, and you can see the heavy police presence behind me here. Lots of NYPD officers lining 6th Avenue. There are sand trucks parked outside of Radio City Music Hall. Secret Service personnel are here, and you can probably hear the protesters, the protest that is happening right now as we prepare for three of the six living U.S. presidents to descend on Midtown Manhattan. Crowds line 6th Avenue in anticipation of a star-studded campaign fundraiser. An historic one, too, as the marquee at Radio City Music Hall reads, an evening with Joe Biden, Barack Obama, and Bill Clinton. And like in New York, as a visitor, it's just cool and it's a cool experience. The sold-out event will feature performances by singers, including Lizzo and Leah Michelle, hosted by actress Mindy Kaling, and a panel moderated by comedian Stephen Colbert. With thousands to be in attendance, the fundraiser is expected to bring in a record 25 million for Biden's re-election campaign. It's also bringing in lots of traffic, closing off 49th, 50th, and 51st streets to cars between 5th and 6th avenues. It's very annoying, especially with this rain. It's not a problem, though, for the area's many visitors. We're tourists here, right? So we're we're fine with traffic, and you know we, we came to New York for excitement, so. This is an exciting day. The political gathering also attracting a pro-Palestinian protest, adding to the chaos. Genocide Joe has got to go! 